you know, hadn't fanned herself off. Natalie, are you okay? Oh, you, no, you were very that's excited. Fine. Um, that's not the indication. Actually, I got. You know, she's a little upset that it stopped raining because she was hoping for the wet Adam right, Levine the white t shirt. The sweater right. hides nah, too much all right. on a chilly that's day. That's okay. Oh. <laughs> she's I'm like, fine. Cut it, guys. I'm all fine right. with it. All right, fine. let's get to our take Happy Father's three. Day. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. You guys are always trying to get me in trouble. What is it no, with you two? You're good on your own in that department. Way to start the show. I love this. This is fantastic. Nine o'clock, some of you may be eating a late breakfast. We're going to help you out here. <laughs> Latest fast food photograph. Oh. We're getting Reddit yesterday along with the line, I was going to buy a Frosty from Wendy's until I saw the employee do this. Someone snapped a photograph. Of Do we know if that somebody was an employee at, at Wendy's? Well, sure, we don't like know it's yet. from behind the yeah, counter. Yeah, from behind yeah. the we counter. Don't know. And the guy's wearing a Wendy's uh, outfit. So we uh, right. You back. send the cut and you just kind of. Oh, right. Yeah. Come yeah. on. You do the swirl where you get That's them right. both yes. They weigh you before. <laughs> Do you get extra sprinkles? And then they weigh you <laughs> afterwards. And whatever the increase in your weight is. But with a person involved. <laughs> you yeah, you eliminate the cup. Right. It's great for the environment. It's true. See that is true. There are advantages. Wendy's uses I'm sure, this. I'm sure Wendy's, Wendy's is, is not loving this, though. Put Jimmy's on your head. <laughs> But you remember this something comes on the heels right. of that Taco Bell ad or that Taco Bell yep. picture that yeah. we saw on employee the owners when we're ordering our food. Well, one, one thing that's happening is everyone has a, a camera now. Right. Do you think this sure. wasn't happening in the 70s and 80s? Oh, yeah. oh it sure. was happening. We oh, just yes. didn't have pictures of it. Right. right? I, I really don't even want to see what's happening <laughs> no. or know more about that. No, you that. don't. No, you don't. <laughs> I, I once Makes worked you swear off a restaurant for but, life. Yeah, right? look, I, you no. got to no. yes. of employees yeah. of these restaurants. To bathe in the sink. Exactly. Right. Any chance to but then dip you know your they head didn't wash their hands. That's right. They're totally, totally in a clean presentation. Come on. I once worked at a pizza joint. I'm not going to give the name. Uh, as you know, if you, were, if you ever worked in a kitchen in the summer, it gets really hot. Yeah. So all the employees would hang out in the walk-in refrigerator. Mm -hmm. Now, the owners of Crush Cigarettes, right over the shredded oh. cheese and all oh. the toppings hey. and everything oh. else. Just I think the worst time. I ever did as, as a waitress at one point was, you know, the customer asked for decaf oh. and... Um, the decaf was gone, so oh, I you know, regular. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Did they start? Yeah. I don't know. It was a sleepless and night. And the customer I'm sure. asked for some gluten free fries, and you just kind of put bread on it. <laughs> We've that all had Natalie. that job. Did we have that job yeah. at one point? You, you just kind of like, I, I can't make another pot of decaf right now. So. Do you ever worry? About, do you ever worry about? <laughs> it takes too long. Sending. Hey, you know what? Customers this isn't waiting. really the facts in the news story. I'm just going to make them up. <laughs> anyway. Okay. Don't you ever worry though about sending food back? Yes. Oh. Based yeah, on what's I'm one happening of those people, back there. I send it back if it's not cooked well enough well, yeah, or whatever, that's fair. and then then you're worried about what comes. What are the extras? What's what are the condiments? I hope everybody's enjoying their breakfast. <laughs> What are the extras? I think oh, we should move. Great yeah, call out. Another That's just great me. Call. We really Another gross people call. out any further. Take two. The Oxford English Dictionary announced its latest update. We get these every year. Uh -huh. 1,200 newly revised and updated words. New words include dad dancing. Now, to demonstrate the dad dancing, <laughs> Let me define Al first. and Willie we will show you before. It's awkward, unfashionable, unrestrained there we dancing go. to okay. pop music. Let's see it. Typically performed by middle-aged or older men. Okay, guys. For me, it's a, a lot of step tough. See, like, yeah, it's, it's that, it's it's that right Will Smith here. hitch, you know? This is where you live. Right right you're listening too. Is there? Oh, yeah. Is that yeah. in the dictionary? Sure, well, absolutely. Michelle Obama did it. Well, yeah, but she's well, good what, at it. But mom about. dancing, is it that we're not as awkward? I guess we're a little no, bit No, mom's going to be just as awkward. <laughs> so you're in the shoulders, too. You're awkward, and you're wearing those jeans. Yeah. <laughs> you get the mom jeans and the mom shoulders. It's a lot of offbeat step touch. Yes. It's a little here. You could do the shopping cart. Right? Wow. You get all the moves. i got to see you right. drunk at a wedding. Let's it's move to take good. three. It's not take good. Three. Moving on to Thank take God three. Thank God for Al today. Let's just say that. Take three. The new face of photographs. There's kind of a clever new ad campaign out in uh, South Africa, actually, that shows iconic photographs as if they'd been taken as selfies. Oh, that's an interesting Let, idea. Let's look at a couple of campaigns. An advertising campaign, yeah. I guess. Yeah, a firm uh, trying to help out a newspaper. You know, it would be great if you could take a selfie as you have your mouth on it already, Al. Um, okay. As part of the iPhone discussion here, yes. there's been a lot of talk lately about what your iPhone case mm -hmm. says about you. Right. What does your iPhone say about you when it it's just disgusting black. and just covered you know with stuff junk? Gets, <laughs> stuff gets in there. Stuff Look at gets that. in there. Ooh. That's just gross. Mine, mine's just plain black, and which means I lose it a lot. But um, <laughs> the, you can get like these. Ice I like down. being dazzled. You mine is very far, boring. Though, I don't. I, I don't have mine with me, but it's plain. It's nothing. It's white. It's a white case. It does nothing. 
doesn't bling. Yeah, it, does, so it says I'm a minimalist. Yeah, you're a minimalist. Okay. Uh, oh, no, I'm sorry. I brought my phone, you know but what? I took it out because out of it was. Scene, it was swooning. Yes. So I could See, I, I, I forgot it. everything. <laughs> now you admit to it. All I think right. Yours is the best, though. I like yours with the. With I'll, I'll, yes. I'll show it to you later. Yes. It's right. worth it. In the meantime, Natalie's got to look at the rest All of right. The let's take a look at the news this morning. And it was a sudden end to a night of partying in Miami when that sports deck bar collapsed. Adorable. Wonderful, majestic end. Yes, beautiful. They're not Disembowel you in a second. Yeah. All right, I'll, Mr. I'll Roker, you're so grim. All right, well, just a realistic. Yeah. Anyway, let's see what's going on. That's I want to show you my, uh, my, my uh, uh, driver's license. Uh, driver's license. Anyway, and that's your latest weather. All right, Al. Thanks. We're about to find out which father knows best. Al and I going head to head. Rulers, these messages. And I get to do it. From them coming up in this half hour, I'm Willie Geis along with Al Roker and Natalie Morales. Coming up, a very special Father's Day story, a guy who grew up without his dad. We're playing a fun game of diet, drugstore, or doctor. We're going to be tested on common health. One more. <laughs> like, Maybe not. Let's just keep her going. See how long she goes. Uh, and that, well, she's going back in, I think. <laughs> I think so. More? It is a really great heartwarming Father's Day story about one son who was determined to find the father he never knew. Yeah, for 29, never had a dad to celebrate with. But one day, all that changed with a simple trip to his computer. Funny story. together. You sit in a room with them, and they're more like brothers. His dad is like yeah. an older brother at this point. They're giving each other grief and Aww. going back and forth. And it's a, it's something that wouldn't have been possible without, without social, social media. media. Facebook Thank made goodness, it possible. right? Brought them together, and they look exactly alike. Yeah, you, you know. can see it right there. We always Sweet. want you to share your stories with us, so be sure to like today on Facebook where you can join our conversation. Coming up next, coping with some common ailments with the diet, the drugstore, or the doctor. We're going to be put to the test. Uh -oh. Here we go, again, right after this. <laughs> Her way in from the plaza, yeah. where she was just rocking out to Maroon 5. Isn't that kind of one of the best parts of this job? Totally. It rocking is. out on a Friday morning? The best. You did the key thing. And you knew all the words. Words, but I just pretend. Right. <laughs> just, just dance. I just, just mouth dance. along. Well, Erica's got to look at what's coming up on Weekend Today. Yes. Um, you know how when you get to the register, the worst part is waiting in line when you get wow. product placements. Very cool. We'll look okay, forward to look seeing forward you. Look forward to it. See you then. Tomorrow. Happy Father's Day. I'll be seeing Man of Steel this much. weekend. Hoda and Kathleen coming.